reasons why you should join Seth Summit Student Government. Good morning, students. Students, the weather is starting to get warmer, and we are seeing too many students who are wearing inappropriate clothing. Shorts and skirts must reach mid thigh when seated and shirts must cover the stomach and back when arms are raised. Also, hoods and hoodies are not allowed to be worn in school at any time. Teachers and administrators will be monitoring this. Please save yourself some embarrassment and make sure you're wearing dress code appropriate clothes to school. Students, tapestry auditions are going to be right after school next Monday and Tuesday, the 28th and 29th of this month. Sign up with the opposite partner opposite of your voice part if you still want to try out you can still try out, but you have to make those times. See Mr. Davis ASAP. This week's scholarship highlight is the BYU Management Society Scholarship. Students who demonstrate financial need and academic excellence may be awarded up to $5,000. Do not, you do not have to be a member of the LDS Church or plan to attend BYU. See the Senior Bulletin Board or Ms. Reagan. Students, from now on, every Monday, we will have an open field from 5 to 6.30 p.m. on the football field. We have a new soccer coach, and we are excited for the girls to come out and meet him. Students, if you want to take the June 11th ACT, you need to sign up on ACT.org by May 6th. Have, have a great, great day, day, students! Are you interested, interested in running, running for student, student government? government? Applications can be picked up at the office ASAP. They are due Friday, March 25th. SBO candidates will campaign all day, Monday, March 28th. You can hang up posters, greet people, and hand out treats, and anything else you want to do. Candidates will need to prepare a one to two minute speech that will take place Tuesday morning, March 29th. Voting will take place that afternoon. <laughs> Class officer elections will follow the same protocol. Campaigning will take place Wednesday, March 30th, and voting and speech will take place Thursday, March 31st. Since SBO elections will take place first, if you are not elected as a student body officer, you can still run for class office. Students will vote for the top five candidates for SBOs and class officer. Those candidates will be interviewed in front of an electoral committee. After spring break, the committee will decide which candidates get which position. Read the following flyer for more details. Mm-hmm.